today's top tip is how to align the blade guide rollers on an LT15 sawmill. When the alignment is set right, the sawmill will cut like it should, but the wrong alignment will slow the mill down in the cut. It will feel like the mill doesn't have power, even with a sharp blade. The cut will also be wavy. Wrong alignment will also cause the blade to break. This happens when the blade rubs against the back collar of the roller. The heat that builds up will cause the blade to snap. We start with setting the alignment by removing the blade guide rollers. Now tension the blade. Start by doing forward tracking first. Turn the wheel by hand anti-clockwise. Adjust the horizontal alignment bolts to move the left and right sides of the blade wheel in or out. Now do the reverse tracking. Spin the wheel by hand clockwise. Adjust the vertical alignment bolts to move the top and bottom sides of the blade wheel in or out. When the distance from the blade gullet to the blade wheel remains even at 3 to 4 millimeters, the tracking is correct and the bolts can be locked in place. The next step is to check that the head is level. Do this by measuring the distance from the bed to the blade. The distance on the drive and idle side must be 250 millimeters. Now set the deflection. It should be 6 millimeters on both sides. That brings the total on both sides to 244 millimeters on the drive and idle side. Once that's correct, lock the nuts in place. Now fit the blade alignment tool. Check that the blade runs level, left and right. If the measurement is out, set the angle of the blade guide shaft to straighten the blade out. Now proceed to set the scale. Do this by lowering the head to the lowest position. The distance should be 25 millimeters from the bed to the teeth that is facing downwards. Now set the ruler on 25 millimeters. The alignment process is now complete.